Open everybody, it's a good Drizzy. Welcome back to Drizzy Radio, a place where we talk about celebrity gossip, celebrity news trending topics. If you're new here, kindly don't leave without subscribing. If you're returning subscriber, I want to say a special shout out to you. Anywho, without further ado, let's continue the mess of the day. Now, today's topic, <laughs> we're going to talk a very, we don't talk about a very, very interesting topic I saw I on social peace. media. I and want problems, you always. You feel about this t- certain topic because uh, it's been trending and people are talking about it. Well, you all know that ever since the situation happened with Zuchu, of course, the family of Diamond Platinums came out to say, since Diamond Platinums has never, he has never introduced us Zuchu, we don't um, accept or recognize that relationship. As far as we know, that relationship is fornication. Uh, it shouldn't happen unless Diamond Platinums want us to recognize it he has to come forward with the lady so that we can recognize the lady as our own family and many people were asking did Damo Platinums did the same with Tanasha or with Zari or with Wema or with any other female the Damo Platinums family seemingly welcomed completely you know, in as much as Diamond was trying to tell us, you know, in a playful manner that him and Zuchu are in a relationship. Some people felt like he wasn't serious enough and that's why his family was kind of, you know, lukewarm into talking about the relationship. One minute they are gracious, the girlfriend. One minute they're saying she's not the girlfriend. Well, one person that people want to hear their opinion or rather his opinion is Demo Platinum's once ago stepdad okay who happened to be queen darlene's dad so this one had a lot to say according to him he's saying the only females the demo platinums has ever bring to him or rather brought up the issue to him uh, and then of course i repeat this was when they were still cool according to what i'm hearing from the streets is they of course cut themselves away from him so they're not as close as they were and maybe his opinion is irrelevant or relevant i don't know which one or how you perceive it but let's le- hear what mze abdul has to say first of all as we continue the mess cause uh, baby yes pengine labda nataka kujua na sibu alishawahi kukutambulisha sara kwamba mzee huyu pia ni mtu wangu enzi hizo mimi katika naga nitambulisha wawili tu ilo ya Kenya Tanasha ndio tukafanya mpaka na shughuli yote na kwa kwanza kunitambusha kabisa alikuwa wema hapo ndo akafuata Tanasha kwa sababu wema alikuwa anakuja paka hapa home anapiga story nini ukimaliza anaondoka Tanasha baada ya shughuli ya mtoto kwenda kule ndio naye akanitambulisha baba mimi ndo nakaa nichukue jiko hapa niwe kabisa sasa hivi <coughs> ni huyu hapa vipi mimi kaambia fresh nini na ina matatizo yote itapokuwa si tuko pamoja lakini mbele yake haikuwezekana sikuelewa sikuingilia kiundani za tatizo ni <clears throat> okay yeah. according to manam so ili listeners what mze is trying to say is Diamond Platinum has only brought two women to him, one of them being Wema Sepetu and another one being Tanasha Donna. Well, somebody might ask me, but between Wema and Tanasha, Diamond dated some women in between. Well, the known one is Zari. My thing is, maybe around the time that Diamond was dating Zari, they were not close with Mze, Mze Abdul, that is. Okay, that's why, you know, it things went the way they did you know what i'm saying maybe they were going through their own little issue just like they are going through it right now because they're being told that the families are not that close uh diamond platinum said that i say that they literally cut him off from any help they're not helping him with anything that's why diamond didn't bring zari to him he also said that the only two women were tanasha and of course uh wema sepetu according to him he's saying that diamond platinum was planning everything and diamond platinum met also with tanasha donna's family and vice versa that is what they was saying he was of course being asked if diamond ever brought sara well the sara that you know people are saying that because of her zuchu is bringing up wahala how can diamond platinum bring one of his exes on stage it's so unacceptable da 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 and d d d d d you know what i'm saying but anyway it is what it is that is what again from there but with mze i feel like you can give him a few coins and he will give you the interview he will always tell you what you want to hear i've heard this man contradict himself one minute he will say one thing 
And then the next minute, I don't know if maybe the blogs are telling him to spin the narrative and speak on what they want to put on their channel or I don't know what the context of what I don't know. Because I, I hear him once say he's saying a certain thing and then when another person interview him, few Hours later, he will say something totally different from what he say initially contradicting stories. You know what I'm saying? Anyway, it is what it is. Those who get it, get it. I don't want to drag somebody's dad, but <laughs> hey, guess who nibuana? Keep your glasses and let's jump in the comment section and tell me how you feel about it down the comment section. Do you actually feel like Mze Abdul is relevant in this story or not? Keep your glasses and let's see you in the next one. As always, bye-bye.